Well, mm -hmm. the season's kind of crazy. The teams <laughs> that are are in first in their conferences weren't, weren't yeah. really expected. And speaking well, of West Virginia, for one. <laughs> well, West Virginia, I mean, it goes back to the fact, uh, you know, all of college basketball is just wild right now. There are no undefeated teams, which is – hasn't happened since the Korean War. Wow. <laughs> Way back. Uh, yeah, you know, to enter the new year of a college basketball season with no undefeated teams is is altogether wacky. Um, you got all these different leagues that are a little bit topsy shit. Now again, it's the first week, week and a half, so you kind of got to measure it a little bit. But like you say, West Virginia is definitely a team to watch. Uh, I mean, who would expect Duke to have two losses now in the ACC this early? I mean, you know, to have two losses now, you got to project, you know, could they lose two more, three more? <laughs> Four more? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, that's – you really got to uh, ask yourself something there. Arizona is another one that's, that's struggled a little bit. Arizona State, everybody was hot on them all the way up, and then they got in the conference play. They've lost two or three. Um, I mean, does that just speak to the parity exactly. of college basketball? Exactly. It's, it's the parity of college basketball. You got parity for one thing. And then you got conference play for the other, which, uh, you know, in conference play, a, 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 you try and re-educate people every year. You know, if you got a good team, I'm not talking about a top 25 team, Ohio State, Michigan State, perfect example. If you have a good team at home and you're ready to play, you can beat people in conference play because you know styles and tendencies and whatever. You're not playing. That's not a team you play once. That's a team you may play six times over a two-year period, you know. Potentially seven if you get into the NCAA tournament and go against each other. So, you know, those are teams you're really familiar with. If you are a good team, okay, not again, not necessarily a top 25 team, but just a good team at home, you should be able to win some of those games, and that's what we're seeing.